My gosh, what a busy weekend it was. And yet, it is Monday, my dudes. And it is time for another episode of the finest show we have to offer the internet, Mostly Walking. I am one of the hosts, Sean Plot, And I'm Lee Brainer. And I'm Sean Bloom. Welcome. We're going to keep playing adventure games, whether you like it or not. What a good way to begin the show, a little bit of adversarial, just kind of defiance towards you beautiful viewers at home. Uh, we're going to be continuing to play um, the sort of mystifying quern. Mystifying both because it is mystical and mystifying both because it are multiple boths. Uh, you can't union both. Uh, mystifying both because the puzzles are a little bit um, confounding, but also because it has that wonderful mystique reminiscent of Mist and uh, Riven. And the good news is we don't even have much to review of the story up to now. In the game, due to the fact yeah, that not much, the game's pretty good at just pinching off all the rest of the uh, areas uh, until we solved one puzzle at a time. I could have used an et, used any other set of verbs, but I chose not to. Uh, and no, and did. before we begin, I want to note that you can discover that things are true and know that things are true without having to verify. And I'd like to share one of those right now. Okay. All oh right. shit! I had a busy day. I had to get up. Okay. I did a, yep. a, a sponsored segment this morning. Uh, okay. Next, sponsored by NordVPN. Then, because it ended at 2, I had to do some work stuff. And then it was like 5, and I needed to get sure. some food, so I wanted to go to the grocery store. I get in my car, and I begin to drive to the store, and wouldn't you know it, there's rain. Rain? Not. I shouldn't even say a lot of rain. It's just, it, it's just considerably moister than it normally would be in Los Angeles. Right, sure. And I knew. I knew, as someone that grew up in Kansas, where you have every type of weather phenomenon possible, it is consistently baffling to me that Southern Californians are just amazed at pretty normal weather events. Oh, yeah. Pretty normal oh, yeah. weather events. So I knew that coming home, I wasn't even going to get on Twitter. I don't use social media that much. I had to eat dinner before doing this. I knew for a fact that the moment I opened dinner, my feed would be full of Los Angeles making some quip about how it's rainy. And I yeah. just tweeted, like... Just before, like I was on this screen, hit the tweet, and then went, okay, hey, we're here. I knew when I opened it, I would see, and it was full of people's gifts of Thor and lightning and shit, and they were singing in the rain things and like Rihanna references, and like, oh, here's what I did now that it's raining, and it's a drink in a cup. Like, what? <laughs> it's just, there's nothing noteworthy happened, you know? Like, but it's like oh, everyone yeah. suddenly has this, like, like well, we. Gonna set aside thirty minutes today to talk about the rain. Yeah, yeah. Um, did PG? Did your power go out? Did PG and E like email you to say that you're gonna turn off your power? No, no. Cause... We we have the Los Angeles Department of Water and Power down here. We don't oh, have. Oh, PG &E. oh, okay, all right. We we, we then we, again we I, have Lad I, Lad. I think San. Lad. I think San Francisco has some deal with the devil too because. All those P and like every time that someone sneezes, uh, PG and E is like, we're, we have to turn off all the power to California, um, except for uh, San Francisco proper. And I'm like, oh, <laughs> missed us again. <laughs> <laughs> Went right around us. Yeah, that's right. The demonetization breeze, the brownout breeze, man. That's great. <laughs> brownout breeze. Well, well, in uh, in yeah. that case, I've just I've been talking way too much, so I need to know since we have been away for two weeks, uh, Lee. What is the most uneventful yet compelling update you have for us of the last two weeks? And Sean, I want to pose the same question to you. What's something that just doesn't matter that grabbed your eye? For instance, a type of clothing that you saw someone wearing at a store. Perhaps right, 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 right. it is a particular line in a particular show that made you wonder. What was that doing there? Just something mm. uninteresting. Fuck. Caught your eye. Caught your fancy. I'm trying to think as hard as I can. Oh, I watched a movie. That was good. I've been oh. watching spooky, spooky ass movies. Oh. Um, I, I watched uh, Hell House LLC, which is <laughs> from about 10 years ago. And Amazing. it is a found footage, you know, post uh, Blair Witch Project film. It's about, here's the pitch. It's so good. Here's the pitch. Um, this group of people who's a, they're a company, a small company that does professional haunted houses. Uh, okay. They um, set up a haunted house in an old uh, hotel, an old abandoned hotel. Old. 
and 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 on the opening night, oh, yeah. fifteen people die. <laughs> and I hate, hate that. I hate when that happens. And, and uh, it just back yeah. for returns. I apologize, Lee. I just wanted to briefly interject again. I'm so sorry, uh, Sean. Aren't you making a haunted house right now? Aren't you working on oh, one of those? Shit. Aren't oh, you working shit. on a haunted house? Oh, I just shit. wanted to just briefly oh, take shit. a moment, and I can't oh, apologize shit. enough oh, for this, God. Lee. Shit. Lee, I'm oh, so sorry, Sean. Are you shit. making a haunted oh, fucking shit. house? Are you doing that? Yeah. Uh, mine already opened, and only like seven people died. So oh. it's pretty. It's pretty okay. Okay. Oh, so you're here in this movie, oh. and you're thinking, I hate when that happens. Yeah. That's a write off. That's okay. a write off. See? Yeah. <laughs> it's. Um. So there was one funny thing about this film too, which is that it starts. It starts the best way. It's like interviews with like local journalists or whatever, and it's just like mm, it's just a guy looking at the camera, and he's like. You know, I don't think anyone's ever going to know what happened in the Hell House. And that's how it starts. And then they keep interviewing more people. And they're like, look, if I had to tell you what happened in that house, I couldn't. And it's just like, and then they just keep going more. And it's like, oh, okay. By the end, like, you get up. Yeah, I end up a pretty good sense, but it does, it does a good job with its purposeful ambiguity. Um, yeah. yeah, it's good stuff. Um, you know, I, I, this reminds me of an interesting question, which is how many openings does a movie have, right? Uh, two, the beginning and the end. That's perfect. That's actually really, really... I'm not even going to follow up on what I was going to say. Uh, Sean, what about you? Sean, tell me about you. I was the opening of The Haunted House, where people definitely did not die. Um, Haunted House is good. Uh, it's a big success. Everybody loves it. Um, I went to the grocery store this weekend, and uh, they were sold out of my my normal flavor of protein bars, Oh, and shit. I had to get a different flavor of protein bars. Supply and chain issues. They're pretty oh. good. They're, it's pretty good. Oh, yeah. Is it gonna change your standard? I don't know. Maybe. Maybe I'll just switch switch between them from now wow. on. Wow. Can, can we guess the flavors? If you would like. Okay. Okay. okay I'm gonna. Oh okay. no, Lee. Lee, you you guess the first, and I'll guess the first, and it has to be different from yours. So go ahead. I'm gonna go crazy right. here. I'm gonna go with something with coconut in it. Okay, so uh, the, now hold okay. on. I think that you had some sort of peanut butter chocolate protein bar was your was your main go to. Was my oh. main go to? Was my original go to? Yeah, it was your original go to. That's correct. Yes. <laughs> okay, yes! okay. 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 I'm so, so sick. Okay. So if that's where you started, then mm-hmm. then then up, up against a wall, you chose something with cranberries in it interesting no okay no. wait uh, um okay well I, I have a little bit of extra information now um which is is it just pure like vanilla oh it's not it's not but okay. i that does sound like something i would choose nine million taste bud <laughs> um i'm gonna put my glasses back on because i look like i'm literally dying i don't know like <laughs> what happened now, now, I guess I'm spooky. I'm spooky for October. Oh, well, I, I have this issue as well where, like, I have extremely thick eyebrow bones, so it always casts a shadow, oh. so I always look like I have huge circles out of my mm. eyes when I'm live. But if I sure. just, like, angle my head up, they disappear. Uh, but but either yeah, way, yeah. what was the final flavor? So the my original is a chocolate peanut butter, uh, and the only one that they had instead of that was a s'mores flavor. Oh, uh, it was like a oh. marshmallow and graham cracker. Oh my uh, gosh! And it's it was pretty good. Gonna need five marshmallows of uh, <laughs> coconut stat. <laughs> marshmallows is how I'm gonna prescribe really, candy really to the family, man. That. Five marshmallows. Oh, that's really good. God, Lee, Lee is just killing it today. Yeah, no, Sean. I'm, I'm I'm high on life tonight. I'm, I don't know what it is. I, I'm popping I, and rocking. I just want to take a moment. To, I don't know if you remember this one, Sean, but we we briefly, um, like when we first got to grad school, bonded over liking um, the the nutter butter bars. Uh, yeah, um, 
Yeah, is that what they were called? Yeah, I don't remember. I, like, totally. Bars? The, like, wafer... Yeah, the wafer peanut butter that, for some reason, the name of it is is escaping me, and I based my entire protein conjecture on that Nutter Butter conversation. Oh, my God. I mean, I, it's Shit. incredible that you remember that, but, uh, yes. I love those things. I have, I have not had one of those in a long time, like, maybe since grad school, but those are real good. You know what they call those in England, right? What, what's that? Nutler Butler Bars. <laughs> it's... It's so close to me going, really? Like, I want badly, <laughs> badly to get an answer to this. Oh, yeah. All right, now All right. it's time to play. I'm going to, I'm going to take, it's time to take it down. I'm going to take it down. That was the intro. And yeah, now we're, I'm going to settle into some Karen. Well, uh, now the, the, um, as I was mentioning earlier, you know, how many openings does a movie have? Um, oh, yeah. Um, <laughs> We're going to catch up a little bit now that we've done the show open with the game open part. Now, it does take a moment to load, hence why it nearly mm. crashes in the middle of that loading sequence. We had some frame oh, rate right. issues early before. Ice wand and a fire wand. What? It's, oh. Is it an ice wand? We do. We did get a um, a blue thing. Well, And well, I wanted to, yeah. try to use the it's, blue thing in the laser. I think yeah. it's more like one is a battery and the other is a... Um, it's the opposite of a battery. So it just is like a wire because you, you can't charge it. Yeah, 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 yeah. So, so we we started in this location, and everything would imply to us that this is a portal. It's a bunch yes, of rocks, right. yes. on top of it's each a, other. It's a portal. Every time I've seen rocks, it's a portal. Yeah, oh, this, yeah. this is a doorway. If it's a doorway oh. with no building on the other side, it's a portal. Okay. So, um. We went into this area, and by the way, th this game uh, is quite beautiful with shadows and quite beautiful with uh -huh. a lot of texturing put on. And for any of you that are going to make any criticisms about this, it just so happens with this particular setup, this game is optimized not for what we're doing right now mm -hmm. with it. Um, so we just mm -hmm. killed the shadows, yeah. instantly fixed all the issues, and it's amazing once again how big of an impact shadows make. Um, if you want to actually improve the look of the stream, you can open up a different Twitch to someone playing this game and overlay that there it on is. the left side of the screen. I mean, that's that's a really good idea, Lee. And I really I love I just, that. That's a, <laughs> if there's one thing we can it's always like rift tracks, on. but yeah. it's like walk so, tracks. So we explored around. We found a number of different uh, various contraptions, such as this interesting sliding puzzle game. Uh, you know, yeah. where we had to like slide things around. I still feel like we did something topologically yeah. impossible. We opened up this door and learned that this entire area was made by a complete self-absorbed prick. Mm -hmm. We started to read. He's just like, oh my god, it's so many amazing cool things. Oh my gosh, we learned that there's these two kinds of crystals. There's these orange ones that basically are all about storing charge. So, for instance, we see that this one, this uh, this guy, it's, it's charged up crystal. We have this other oh, yeah. sort of bluish one that is not really good at charging any crystal. You can see that this wind device is generating electricity. But what we learned is that if you shine light through this blue thing, it can basically let yeah. you see hidden writing and see things on the walls. So we got That's something. That's why we have a portable blue thing. Yeah, so I I'm actually just catching up. So we have these two different torches and this one, again, this is the the an orange crystal torch that um, can store up energy and, and we sometimes place it in locations to activate stuff. This yeah, blue one, uh, if you'll recall, we place the blue one into here. And there was an electric eel we found in the water that apparently was enough to charge this puppy. Otherwise, we'd have to like do this stuff. So with these contractions, that eel is just like what? normally electric eels would use that as a defense mechanism, but that guy's just firing on all just, cylinders twenty four seven. He's going, yeah. He is all in. And so we have a couple of locked doors to us. We can't get through oh. this one. We. Basically, for every door that we have found, it's given us the tool to open another door, which has given us the tool to open the other door. And what, the last thing that we left Good on system. was we oh, appear pretty. to have opened up a contraption that almost implies that this will let oh, us yeah. get to this Amogus. tower. 
Right. Now, there's a whole bunch of other locations that we can go to, but the notable thing is that once we figured out that we could electric eel charge up this puppy, we now have a torch that allows us to see some of this hidden writing. And so this little set of buttons has a swirly, whirly dwirly on it. And I have absolutely no clue what to do. So we figured- I, did, Wait, didn't we solve this? I Well, I mean, this didn't open. Oh, right. Because we went Are we just? Are we just holding a black light and that's that's just like somebody's protein? Sorry. That's... <laughs> yes. <laughs> It would not it would not surprise me with this character who's just like, oh my god, I'm gonna leave a hint for him to get into this door. I'm such a genius. <laughs> Leaving hints. Well, I took a I, I, I crossed a line and then you scrummaged it to the line of scrimmage. Yeah, no, here's the thing. If anyone ever crosses the line with me, especially for things that are like really, really gross, I just immediately keep going. I have absolutely And that makes you a hero. Thank you, thank you. I like to think so. <laughs> um so this game has this property where pretty much everywhere that we have been to has, let me actually just inventory and switch to this one. So that way our screen stops glowing so much. Every room has pretty much just had like one notable object in it that has been very clearly marked or delineated in, in some way. Um, you know, like there was one here. And so it's, I think it's unlikely that we've missed stuff. But if we just take a look at our map, Here's where we are. Here is the um, door coated in semen over here. Um, here's the lighthouse. Here is the crystal lab that we went to. So there is a sort of yeah. mysterious, I'll actually just show all the various closed barricades, right? So we have this, closed. we can't get through here. There's also this weird little thing. Ugh. Oh yeah, that thing. That we don't really seem to be able to, oh, I mean, maybe we can try this one. You'd think it does have a different there. handle. Yeah. I didn't notice before that it has a different handle. Yeah, well, it's actually interesting. Oh, yeah. So it has We've one of these. We've already started collecting a variety of uh, sort of sticks that we can yeah. put into holes and stuff. Yeah. A variety of sticks, you know. So Aren't they playing at the Orpheum on Sunday? <laughs> <laughs> so we, we have these unusual shapes that can't do anything with right now, it seems. Among us. Mm -hmm. We have this door that we can't open. And I don't think opens from this side. It doesn't seem to have a handle. One thing we know about our character is that we have very little uh, amount of uh, upper body strength. Because we are constantly thwarted by like rickety, rickety old wooden splinters that yeah. we can't push. That so, is true. Well, there is this thing. I don't know what that is. I feel like I want to hit it with a hook shot. Yeah. And then failing that, an arrow. So we also have this gate. We can actually yeah, almost get right. over to there, but we, we can't can almost do it. We don't know how to lower this bridge. Maybe that's another thing to do. We. I think a real life hook shot, if you weren't strong enough, could rip your arm off. And wouldn't that be a thing to see somebody do that? <laughs> you might think they did it on purpose. And you'd In, be like, what are you doing? I I, the, I feel like the, the, the mechanism by which your arm is attached to your torso is considerably stronger than your grip strength. Right, I guess it depends on how the hookshot is. Yeah, it is just a grip, isn't it? It's a um, punch dagger. And believe it or not, our character is unwilling to just walk over here. This is this is ridiculous. Well, we, I will not walk on rocks. Excuse me. Yeah, we're definitely a a, a little. Um, we're just we're just a tiny little person with tiny little no muscles and then uh, yeah, we, a giant brain, a giant so, problem solving brain. Let me describe our body, okay? First of all, imagine <laughs> if you just get a rectangular prism, like just a block of clay, okay? Yeah, and imagine sure. that you literally took. One M&M &M and a second M&M, &M, boom, those are the legs, okay? We have little M&M uh -huh. &M legs and we can just do this. Now we happen to have, out, out of our, out of our, the center of the slab are just fingers. 
to hold things. So we just sure, shuffle sure, around sure, sure. And so we can like turn and manipulate objects and insert things into other things. Sure. But that's yeah. all we can do. If you need us to like bend over, like it's it's hard. All right. I'm gonna need fan art of this. Fans. I'm not sure what the character's name is. So we kind of have these very obviously this is a door locations. Right. Now, if I keep running across, these we activated earlier. and that's... Those we did do, yeah. Yeah, this was part of a puzzle that... What is this? Very... Yeah. There's also this mysterious door over here that is a push door that we refuse to push. And I'll push. This game is really pointing out to me how story-driven Mist is. Because I'm... And I know we already said this last time, but my big criticism so far is that this game does not get me with the story. Right. And uh, that's the biggest difference I've seen. Also, oh, you know what? Here's the other thing. In Riven, it was like, oh, all of this is like this for an in-game reason. I can learn about this world by looking at these items and objects. Whereas this, in this game, I'm like, oh, oh this shit. is all designed this way to look like Riven. Okay, so we, we actually can put something into here. And I did uh, not realize there are many fingers in there. <laughs> and you just drop it off? Yeah, what the heck? Put part of that eel in there. <laughs> so the only two inventory items that I have is a blue torch and a... Uh, and a... Uh, I don't want to say it, but I'm going to need to have to. Uh, uh, orange and a blue torch. Wow, that was hard for me to just find the words for it. I yeah. understand. Hey, I don't, did we talk about this last week uh, or last time? Um, is this saw? Are, are we in saw here? Yeah, we're in kind of a gentle saw. Yeah. Um, kind of just like a like a low key saw sort of a thing going on here. It's it's a low key saw, but it's definitely got more like it, with a with a little bit more flavor of like. Um, Gen has from from Riven, and then also like it's if you dated Gen in college, like that's what this guy is. Um, he's like, like you're gonna go to a party with your friends, and he's like, I'm just not sure I'm comfortable with that. It's like that kind of guy. Wait a minute. So we can't. I don't actually... speak from experience at all. That's uh, it's fine. So I'm trying to think like, okay, so. We, we did learn that we could take this and put this in here, and if we use yeah, this, we can actually, like, shine light through well, things. We can't anymore. Oh, that one. Okay, that one's good. Yeah. But I'm More wondering. The horde. And we, can we burn ants with that? If you could find me an ant, I would burn it. Well, the thing is that, like, I can shove this blue one in here, but it doesn't really seem to do anything. It's it's much more diffuse. It's a much larger spot. Jesus Christ. You're like a Flintstones theater tech right now. <laughs> so, 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 if I take my theater tech self over here, mm. this is the only other place that we have not really figured out what to do with. Where there's this oh, yeah. thing that when we put this thing in the thing, like that, that we we see that there's like some little stuff here, but we don't see what it does. And I I, I thought that I had a revelation about this that had to do with the wires coming out and connecting to all of the other wires, but then I think we did that thing and it didn't help. So it was just thinking. You know what I just thought was, okay, so this entire place runs on these torches. Isn't it a little weird that he only made two of them? And then I remembered, oh, no, he built this to be exploits and feats or whatever it was, right? Exploits and feats? Yeah, he wanted to see uh, how much he could push the crystals. God damn it. Mm. But, it but it was also in part made to, to um, as a puzzle box into which we would be placed. So, I know, like, I know. He wants us to play a little game. So it's like, I've built this a little shitty. I've built this shitty on rock and soil. Wow. Whoa, holy shit. That was a music song parody that came out of nowhere. It did. Um, so wait, wait yeah, a minute. Just wait let it flow through me. So there, there, this is the window. If I put this here. Yeah. 
does this mean? I mean, mean? It, does, it sounds like there was a thing that happened when you did that. Like, it went... Does it, like... Because it's right here. Because it's, like, right there. Can you, can you just bust through that wall? Is there a sledgehammer in this game? I don't know. Sort of, uh... Like, um... What was that? Red... Red Faction Gorilla? Red... Is that a game? Did I just... Are those three it words? sounds like a Don't game. I mean, it you could definitely convince me. The It's gorilla with a U, though, not with an O. The, oh. I feel like the... Well, either one of those games would probably be good. Red Faction Gorilla. Yeah, I would play either of them for, for, for two hours, for sure. Man, I don't know why. Yeah, I don't know why I'm so, like, uh, my brain is just so on tonight. Well, I sometimes that's a good wonder. Feeling. I know. Maybe it was. Uh, I had. I had uh, pesto pasta before the show. You Do you think that loaded. did it? Yeah, 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 yeah. For me, like not eating pesto. Uh, that's that, if, or you eat just like a little tiny bit. That's where it's at. Well, okay, you know what so, they did. Oh, hmm, so no, yeah, no, we're both leave. arms up right please. now. Please. Um, I was just going to say with that pesto pasta, I also threw in a little bit of milk and a little bit of mozzarella cheese and mixed it all up. Oh. Yeah. So you can imagine how that was. Anyway, sorry, you were you were saying? You were playing a video game? What do we do? Um, I mean, that that blue laser, I held my... I hung my whole hat on that blue laser. I, I don't know now what to do. Um... Wait, hold on. Do 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 the blue torch and then the orange torch and listen to how it sounds. Whoa, that's got an extra little Dr. Right? Octopus arms. Something's moving. Something's activating so when you put that orange torch in there. We're going to A-B test this on this other torchy spot. Okay. So, like, I, I, I have strong confidence that this key needs to get opened up somehow. Mm. Is there a way to like get this to shine onto them somehow? Whoa, what is that? Waves. It's contact. I also don't really feel like that's what the blue laser does. Like the blue laser, it, I have been taught, the blue light is for revealing things. It looks, it looks like it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. So this, this this seems to make make a sound. Sean, does that imply that at some point we're gonna have to use the blue light and that uh, in that amplifier uh, lens thing to make sort of a reveal -y gun, like a reveal cannon that we that's aim sort at something? Of a reveal cannon, yeah, that's what I was imagining. Wow, just the concept of a mounted rifle that you point at something to reveal the truth is. Uh, I would read that graphic novel for sure. Wait, that's got a five-pointed bottom. Doesn't one of our torches have a five-pointed bottom, or am I completely I don't, my gourd? I don't think that it is actually five-pointed. I think it's... Aye, aye, we, aye, aye, aye. We, tried, we tried, like, walking up the whole line, right? Yes. So now, oh, do you want to try two hits at the points? Like, what do we want to do? No, not really. <clears throat> I see what you're saying. Oh my gosh, I just um, don't understand why it would ever- I think it's not- I think it's not powered. Yeah, I- we gotta find more pentagons. I... Hmm. That is weird that we, um... This is one of those two puzzle doors, isn't it? Yeah, yeah, we have half the puzzle. And we can can we spin those or are those set? The oh, are I think set. I, I think I know what we're looking at here. It's not going to bring us up to it. It's going to bring the thing down to us. See how it slides the among, among us guy down? Oh, how oh, I see. Okay. Interesting. Now I wonder. Oh, so those are actually those are like um, 
Like, we gotta slide those out. Those are oh. like bolts. Oh, like they're gonna keep it from fucking going upward? What or is it, downward. on a spring? It's almost like a lock. Those are like tumblers. Yeah, those are like, yeah, sort of, yeah. But I don't even know how to manipulate them. I'm blowing my mind trying to figure out how that, what is it, lid of the thing is attached behind it? Did that pop open at some point? Yeah, yeah, yeah. This used to be oh, in God. the ground, and then it, the whole shaft came up. Um, I'm feeling so quern right now. I'm completely <laughs> querned. Querned. We've got a dongle. That's a dongle. That's a that's a dongle. Have you tried knocking? <laughs> yeah, Quern. My name. Wait, who is Professor what? I, it's we have just... we got somebody's name? Yeah. No. Professor William host? Maythorn. Oh, Although I bear shit, responsibility I... for trapping you in this world, I have no intention of harming you in any way. Yeah, it's that guy. It's the douche. It's I didn't realize he douche. gave us his full name. Of course Ugh. he would. And his title. You ever known someone who, like, got a PhD in something and demands to be called doctor all the time? Constantly. But, like, not even in an educational setting. Just like yeah. you're at their house hanging out and they're like, please call me doctor. And I'm like, why would I do that? <laughs> um, the answer is no. I, I don't know anyone like that. But could imagine i can oh, imagine man. being that person <laughs> i could i could put myself in those shoes i mean what uh, we're we're masters right so we could be like call me fine master Lee. oh yeah I, I always forget that we we all have the exact same degree graduated at the exact same time mm -hmm. we have we have um terminal degrees we have the maximum education you can have as a practicing artist <laughs> we, we literally we 100% speed run this shit. Yeah. Like, we're out. We're out of content. There's nothing else to do. It's done. This is the end game. It is done. <clears throat> well, I think we're maybe out of content in the game. Okay, so, so, um, this is. Okay, no, go ahead. I got nothing. So, I'm gonna begin by saying I'm not asking for a hint yet. I'm not okay. doing that. Don't you dare give me a hint. Don't you even give me a hint to a hint. And I do mean that seriously. If you give me a hint to a hint, you're banned for life. Um, but oh, in shit. a moment, I'm thinking that we should start to ask some really vague questions. Now, don't answer these questions. But things like, is there an object that we've missed? Right, right, right. Things right. like, is there a place that we can explore, but we just haven't looked? <laughs> Is there you another... sound like an art teacher right now. <laughs> well, I could become one. I do have a terminal degree after all. Oh, it's just like so funny. You're like, we should begin to ask some very vague questions. We want to begin with the most abstract question of all. What isn't is? And all that sort of shit. Like what? What is exactly. art? It's no, you, um, could do, you could do really well with that, especially so, if it was over Zoom, you know. So here's here's the first um, here's the first question. I am gonna ask this question. Uh, now, Lee, Sean, do you have any objection to me asking this question? No, no. I don't think so. Okay, of here's, the people or yeah, I'm gonna ask question of, uh, okay. of people. Okay, sure. so so hint givers in chat. When I ask the question, type hint colon, and then the answer. Okay. Wait, but is this a thing where like they have a certain amount of time, and then when you say stop, if they submit it after that, they're banned for life? Is this some that's sort of true? You got to be careful. <laughs> this is this is this is child's play. Okay. Is there an object we've missed? You don't have to say hint colon, but just With please be clear. Is there an object we've missed in this area? Yeah. In the in the area that we've been where we've explored. <laughs> Your yeah. 100 says hint. No. Super Rodan says hint an colon object. and then the okay. answer. Okay. <laughs> okay, ne next question. Is there an interactable that we have missed? 
and by that interactable, we just haven't even seen, we haven't interacted with, or maybe uh, like you haven't seen us interact with it. Wow, like this, this is an yeah. interactable, right? Yeah. Because I mean, Where? I feel like there, I should be able to. That, that yeah, that should be. Superintendent says no. There's not an interactable you've missed. What the heck? And so, last question, Super Odan. Is there a right half to the office that we missed? Yeah, is there is there like extra locational things that we have not found? Like for instance, maybe we're dumb and just like didn't check the basement. Man, Wait, that's what a is very that rug? Wait, rug, hold on, yeah. look at that rug again. What's up with that rug? Oh, I see. Yes, it's an audio wave file for a song that goes. <laughs> Super Odan says no. You have been everywhere you can be at the moment. Okay. That rug was made by someone whose left arm is slightly shorter. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, that's so good. Oh my god, that's actually... I mean, that's so clever. Thank okay. You. Good at see. I actually well, love the idea. Um... Shadow Adam says, is chat a magic eight ball now? I love the idea that chat can only give us hints that are the things that the original magic eight ball could say. Yeah. Oh. Hey, look at that. Why is that lit up? Because the door's open. Oh, shit. Wait, oh. it's got a standby light? So th this is the thing that I... Why would you need a light that tells you that the door's open? I mean, I think that the light is indicates that the door has power, and the door is open because it has power. So this is kind of like the opposite of Facebook. Or <laughs> what? What? Is, what is this room? See, I I think this is this puzzle is not it. I think we need. Sean, a... this is the cocaine cigar factory. It was... Yeah, I know, right? Like this is. <laughs> Like, this is where you snip, and this is where you measure out the kilo, right? There it is. Yeah. Oh, my God, I love the Seeker 42. Posted a whole bunch of Magic 8-Ball answers. Like, yes. cannot predict now. Concentrate oh. and ask again. Don't count on it. My reply is no. And it says, the only acceptable responses to Sean's queries. That's really good. I love it. The only that's possible really, responses to my querns. Querns. Now, now, how do I, how do I <laughs> open this thing? Okay, look. Here's... here's Here's what I'm thinking. I'm, I'm just so curious about that one particular particle effect in the water. That single white water rapid that we see down there. <laughs> this has to be it. Maybe, yeah. do you have to tap it when you're not shining a light on it or some stupid crap like that? I mean, that doesn't that make would any be, sense. That would be ridiculous. I think you went one too high there. Oh, no, you're right. So. You're right. Oh. You're right. You're right. Uh. Have we okay. seen this anywhere? Is this referring to some other th like things? You know, one, two, three, four, or five. <laughs> yeah, I don't believe it. Uh, what about uh, gears, though? Have we seen gears anywhere else? It's weird that there's just decorative gears on this. Yeah, I don't think we've seen a lot of gearage anywhere else. Those gears look like they are primed to animate. Those look like a 1,000% two-dimensional animation just waiting to play. You think so? I'm pretty sure that they, like, they span off into space. Like, there's, there, there's no room for them to be actual full circles. I don't know, but that comment just blew the doors off my universe when you said it. Okay, I... I it's like, I'm not sure that the wheels within wheels can be attached to the angels that way. I, I actually am going to make a conjecture. I think that we have All everything right. we need to solve this puzzle right now. That's what I think. This one Don't give me a hint. Nobody give me a hint. I have my little baby cat here. Yeah, baby cat. Oh, ask the cat for a hint. Sheriff. Sheriff, look at me. Do we have everything we need? Well, let me mind meld with her. Okay, she's hungry. Um, okay, oh. all right. All right, okay. I don't know if that helps. Um, <laughs> the 
the secret for it says reply hazy. Try again. <laughs> That's my favorite. I like that one. Oh, hello. <laughs> oh, what a good cat. Um, I mean, like, okay, so, so, like, here's the thing. Um, all right, we're gonna ask for a clue. Do we have everything we need to solve this puzzle? This one that we're looking at, this door. Yeah, this, this one that we're looking door. at. Because it, it could be the answer is no. Yeah, I think the answer is no. I think we need a pentagon. Oh, okay. Sheriff, you're not a help at all. All right, shit. Secret 42 says clutch. ask again later. <laughs> all right, hold on. I got to rotate. All right, Sheriff Bear. If you wish to stay, you must go onto the shoulder. Solicitous, solicitous plushy. That's is that what your cat is, is being status, right now. Yeah. All right, so this this is the cat is status catus. All right, so so. Okay, so what about you, over here? You really did just equip that cat, didn't you? Yeah, yeah. No, I'm wearing. You just ass. tapped it and put it's, it under it's in your, the neck your slot character right now. Yeah. <laughs> See what what about this weird freaking? Can you shine the blue laser on that thing? Uh, I'm not sure. Oh, that's cool. I'm gonna go try that shit. Yeah, what if I what if I do this? Okay. Okay, Sean, let's let's give this one a shot. Okay, because there's this weird that does it is pretty weird. It seems pretty weird. What it, what does it do even? It's hooked up to wires. I do feel like the wires are a clue. Oh, those those guy wires they have? Well no, there's like those those oh, are the, like the electrical cables. wires, yeah. The cables. I thought you were talking about those, those boss ass pythons. Okay, so let's let's try some things. Um Okay, so first things first, let's go back and let's try this. Let's, let's try this thing. We we've literally made no progress at all today. This is awesome. This is exactly why we do this show. Is to torture people who uh are hoping to see some people achieve things. <laughs> Not today. Not today. Everybody. Not right. today. We've done a hell of a lot of walking. God, we, that's actually that's true. mostly what we've done. It is. Yeah. Mostly. I swear to God, if there's a little switch that opens a door, I'm going to fucking stab the viewers at home. <laughs> I'm going to Whoa. I'm going to download a knife, and I'm going to stab you over the internet with it. Shit. Uh... Okay, so I'm gonna. Some of you were like, "No, Dean, I don't." Uh, absolutely stabbed, stabbed as fuck. No, I. Oh, am. brutal, wrecked. <laughs> got him. I got him, Lee. Wasn't that cool? Yeah. <laughs> got him. Yeah. They know where it's at. They know where it's yeah. at. Okay, so where where even would? What about um, the for the horde sign up there? Did we ever figure that out? The the horde banner. Because that seems that like a razor it out, Yeah. It says two, and it's got a. Oh, does web it say it. two? I didn't even see the two. Yeah, it has uh, a spider web design. Okay, this, and it has two. The spider web is similar to the thing that's on the letter that Professor Dipshit gave us. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And, <laughs> and that's because Professor Dipshit. <laughs> uh, I should shine the laser on that one. You'll it never on make it into my tall, tall tower. <laughs> that was the original name of this game, Tall, Tall Tower. <laughs> All right, so I, I have a couple working theories. So I can't actually see that blue thing from here. I mean, okay. All right. Well, I think it's on this rock. Ugly furs. So I actually am wondering if, first question, if I drop this thing in here. Yeah. Drop it like it's slot. Did this turn on something over here? Yeah, good question. Wrong way. Did 
Didn't turn on that. Okay. Um. The island is hungry. Okay. Uh, Super Odan. You you've played this right. I think it's time for a maybe, a maybe just like an actual guiding hint. But I I will only call on one person at a time. And Fully it has to rhyme. Yeah. Yeah. Are we, okay. <laughs> or 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 um or seeker. <laughs> Does one of you wish oh, to volunteer? Because I'm at, I'm at the point where I'm like, we've been playing for like 45 minutes. We haven't done nothing. Only once is real talk. Chats are yeah. is pretty impressive, yeah. Super Rodan says, hint, you must use the blue torch somewhere. Um. Okay, wait. Okay. The blue torch. I don't think it's there. All right, I'm going to... Oh, oh, okay. Yeah, go check. Why not? Go check. Why not? Why not? Hello? Okay. <laughs> God, I wish you could jump. And every time you that you jump, you I... can Oh, jump. you can? Yeah. Well, then I wish you yeah, could Yeah, it, it doesn't do anything. <laughs> 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 Okay, so that's the quake guy, right? The quake guy has some pretty good jumping ha, sounds. Ha. <laughs> okay, so I mean, I feel like the thing, that, the only thing that I feel like makes any sense here anymore. Th this is the only other place that I know where to place this fucking thing. Yeah, you gotta shoot that at some beamers, but the good thing is you should be able to tell when it lights up something you can read. There we go! Right? See? Oh, there oh, we oh. fucking go! Can't believe the timing! I told you it was a reveal -o laser! You did, but I never—I didn't think we'd use it to reveal anything. <laughs> a Thomas reveal -o laser I mean, okay, okay, so now we have a bunch of symbols that I literally, I don't know how well, to so make heads or tails the, of the these. So obviously the first like, one is a radiator and a Brooklyn walk-up. The uh -huh. bottom one is a uh, titanium percentage. And the middle one is, uh, is something else. So it's triangle, circle it's like, in a corner, nearly pi, and percent. And this, we've seen this object before. Um, Have we? Yeah. I'll show you where. Oh, oh, we are really thin here. We're thin with our M&M &M feet. Very, very thin. We don't cast shadows. I guess that's the thing, right? <laughs> Just 9000 This is what I feel one. like. It's a we're fan symbol for AOC. And I... <sighs> Good. I don't know. I don't know about that, Sean. Shit. Wait, can, could you please, uh, if you would, uh, look upward and to the left of where you were when I started that sentence? What's that? What's that right there? This is that's the symbol a for the door that's right yeah, there. Yeah, use that to okay. open the thing. Got it. Okay, now where have we seen this shit before? Because um, do we ha we don't have this percentage symbol anywhere. Oh, shit. We don't have... Oh, no. None of this is anywhere at all? That's what I'm saying. No, We haven't seen any of that. Um. Well, maybe we gotta get the old revealer laser going again. I mean, we only started with that bad boy, right? Okay, what does it mean? What does it mean? How to get burned? How to get burned? <laughs> How to get burned? Not the bees. Not the bees. That's a. That looks like a, uh, like a motor, right? Like a. You know, if you point that at your crotch. You're gonna have a bad time. Or, or a good time. Or gonna have a oh. smoky well, rotch, rotch crash. Or even a smoky rotch. Smoke? A smoky rotch crash? Yeah, I meant to say crotch rash. You know how it is. So I wait. Think smoky rotch crash is an amazing name for someone. Uh, somebody please go get that uh, Twitch name right now and then subscribe and okay. uh, comment. <laughs> uh. So, so, high percent just as a concept is <laughs> kind of blowing my mind a little bit. Director KOJ said Smoky Roch crashes in the next MTG set. 
Yeah. Now, are you talking Smokey Rotch Crash Bringer of Light? Or are you yeah. talking Smokey <laughs> yeah, Rotch I, I Crash like, uh, Ultimate Denier? I like Rotch Crash the Unwashed <laughs> Rotch is my favorite, Rotch. you know? <laughs> um, yeah. That brings to mind also the fun and whimsy of inventing Magic the Gathering counterspell names. Oh, yeah. Like, uh, uh, like total, uh, total un... Yeah, firm to dismissal. <laughs> what, what is it? It's got, there's got to be one in total un, uh, oh, like total unacknowledgement. <laughs> like, <laughs> total yeah. disregard. Total disregard. Total yeah. disregard is pretty good. St yeah. <laughs> Stern denial. Yeah, I, 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 they're so good. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Is there a motorboat? Do we have a motorboat that I just haven't seen? We have nothing at all. All right, Super Odan or Smo or uh, not Smokey. Uh, sorry, that's the name of our our um, new magic card. Um, Super Odan or Seeker. Is this the thing that we needed to find to advance? When you said you need to use the <laughs> it's not when doing me a lot. A lot of good here. Um, it is. Okay, this is what we needed to find. Okay, so okay. if we... Wait a goddamned minute. Is that a cow with long ears? <laughs> That's from Lincoln Logs. <laughs> Link Con Logs. Thank you, Link Con. <laughs> I love when someone spells something just in a funny way so that only halfway through saying it do you realize that you're going to say something silly. Yeah. Isn't it this? Hold on, hold on. Is it this? Simply attach your shirt to the hook and lower yourself into the water. <laughs> what, what is that shape? What shape? Like it's a, it is a motor. It's not a motor. Is, is this one of the things? This is one of those outdoor exercise things they put in a park in like 1975. It is. Look, no, look. See, here's the. Oh here's shit! The two ears. That's the thing. That's the radiator. Okay. Yeah, that that is the radiator. Okay, wait, hold it on. It does look a lot like a radiator. Now, the game okay. told me a hotkey for taking a photo. I don't remember it. Um, P. Uh, um. Yeah, it's P. Fuck yes. So, are you telling me that somebody put a, a blacklight picture diagram of just another puzzle that we already solved? <laughs> what kind so, of fucked so, up? So now we gotta we gotta figure out what this thing is. What? Okay, wait, so if I go to... What you don't realize, Lee, is that it's procedurally generated. Like, the game oh, looks sure. back at puzzles that you have already solved, and then right. it generates an image of one of those. Oh, right. It's a, uh, it's a classic memory lane puzzle. It's a, it's a, <laughs> it's a nostalgia machine. Okay, so wait, here, here is, it's here's the, here's the pie. It's upside down. Oh, it is. No, that's not the same thing. I mean, is there anything triangular here? It's not here? the same thing. Is there anything percent-wise here? I don't think there is. No, none of no, the symbols are. we're off are. the map. We're off the map. It's a whole different language. Um, quick question. Um, oh wait, we, we actually don't need this because we took a photo of this. So what if I go back to those bricks? And look at it, look with blue light? Yeah, maybe maybe they're just covered in reminders, arcane, arcane reminder, arcane notes. Oh, they're they're right oh. in there. Oh shit! Oh shit! It. Oh my That's god! Good. That's good. Fuck! 
You thought these blocks wouldn't have anything written on them, didn't you? Well, <laughs> uh, hello. Wait, hold on. What, what what is our guy's name again? I gotta remember this so that way I can keep talking to him. Professor Professor William Maythorn. Ah, yes. Maythorn. Yes, Professor William Maythorn and his stains. Um, fucking. Uh, Damn it! What the hell? Ugh. All right. So now let's look at this because it should be. All right. Percent. Pa, or percent circle pi percent or not percent it's Did triangle take a circle. Fucking delta, break delta from like uh, triangle circle, pi, circle. settling New Jersey or something to come set this up oh man it's a series of simple logic games each constructed out of rough hewn materials on a strange island so, I'm not a huge fan of the mysterious circumstances surrounding very basic uh, puzzles. Like, uh, you get that in um, Seventh Guest, you know, and stuff, too, where it's like, this is a haunted uh, fucking um, crossword puzzle and shit. This is a haunted crossword puzzle is pretty good. It's a okay. horrible word find. I don't know how you did that, but that was pretty fucking good. Yeah, it's the well, now what? mechanism. I go back to the mountain? I don't know, the mountain told you to do it. I would say look for an Arduino attached to it. <laughs> yeah, is there a <laughs> Yeah, did I? <laughs> I still have my Arduino kit, man. I love that thing. Oh, wait a minute. Fritter7 says, am I dissing the spooky Sudoku? That's true. You know, that is the exa the, 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 uh, the thing that proves the thing. That's You're right. The spook doku was didn't, spooktacular, and I won't didn't I denigrate it. it was, the, I agree. It was the good. exception that powers the ruler. Wait, 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 yeah. wait, 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 wait. I, I realize that I might be interpreting this incorrectly. Because okay. is it supposed to be that it looks correct from this angle? Or is it or supposed to be above? that it looks correct well, from this Okay, but the, the triangle only goes one way. Right? Like... That the should triangle be how we in the diagram that, Right? Like, this is oriented properly. Yeah. I thought the triangle was on the bottom row. No, it was... It was... Delta arrow pi. Oh, you're right. Triangle is in the middle, and the top row was just the picture of the radiator. Okay, yeah. so let's go to our notebook. Yeah, triangle pi pi this. There's still okay. just fucking um, something shine, about... the, shine the other light on it. Shine, shine, a, shine this little light of mine. Shine the red light. I'm gonna let it shine. Uh, I, I don't think you have to Jack put on red light. Um, take the bucket. Can't even interact claim, with the bucket. Claim it. Uh, this is my bucket. What did we get out of there? We took a, we took the... We took, uh, like a brick. And then we used it somewhere? Wait, that sounded like something. Yeah, I mean, it's the same... It always sounds like something, but maybe it's the thing we need it to be. The thing is very tall. I'm not sure why it's that tall. Oh my god. It has a definite guillotine feel. <laughs> okay, what if you... Because you could conceivably shift this to be in the right hand corner the bottom right hand corner is that worth yeah I don't know. yeah why Anything? not why not i, I mean there's know. people that know the answer that would certainly get really pissed off if we just committed to doing that so i don't really see a reason that we should let them off easy so let's see if i can come here you little fuck french revulsion Fire spoon. Fucking move, you fucking piece of shit. I did it. It needed coercion. I'm just a block. I am only a block. 
Oh, oh, it was. I are scooted you over one. Kidding me? Oh, I did Why? it. Why? A Kia Star. Oh my God! Yeah, that feels amazing. Open up. Ah, yes. It's another room. Are you fucking kidding? That's the secret. That's the secret. The key Look, to success. Okay. Go, no, oh, no, 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 no. You know the book, The Secret? The fucking... Google the, Google the image of the front of the book, The Secret. What do you mean? Just the uh, book called The Secret? Just Google what it looks like. The Secret Book is what I Googled. Mm -hmm. I mean, mm -hmm. and, 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 and that book purports to be, you know, the secret to success. The secret, I think, and then... Oh, well, this is a letter. It, oh, my, oh, I God. mean, it, no, it's a letter that oh, looks like Oh, we, we got a plug. Is we that got, not a, is that letter not a graphic on the book? No, I think... Oh, it's, it's not! Oh, oh shit! I thought it was just, like, I his self-help bullshit book. As you probably noticed by now, this world has no day-night cycle. Nor oh, what it changes. And the shadows oh, cause huge graphical <laughs> issues. The concept of time has a different meaning in this place. For one who stays in this world, the relative time in other worlds appears static or fixed. Which is this incredibly, incredibly powerful fast. phenomenon also prevents the aging of living tissue. When I realized this, I was eager to find out what kind of eternal source gives Quirin this extraordinary power. He said it. <laughs> it made me forget the task I originally came here for. The archaeological exploration of the Dolmarian city has become irrelevant. What does it say? Time. Time. Time commander. commander. Time commander of all things. It says you must obey the dance commander. Oh, oh yes. you motherfucker. Damn. This guy. The keys to success. Oh. You've probably figured out that this is an adventure game. Well. <laughs> so if we get like a random, like, if we scuff our knee in this world, like it just doesn't heal because living tissue daren't age. Correct. Okay. Okay. You oh. Fuck. This is some, some room style shit here. Yeah. Yeah, so this will fit in nicely here. Oh, wait. Uh, okay, so there's a dash on this side. The dash? There's like a little, there's a little dash, right? So you see how there's a little dot here? So we need to get it up with respect to the dot. Oh, okay. You know, the narrative is now gripping me because now I just want to like, like, Get, you know, show this guy up, basically. Like, you know, I'm. I just want to track him down and. Fuck you, fucking. Call what? him a dick. What? I mean, this clear. This clearly corresponds. Yeah, but what do you put the key into? That key's too big also, to go in there. Also, there's right? one. There's one that has no, four, uh, doesn't down. it? Like, yeah. you, you're not gonna yeah, but be the able fourth to. Is... Oh. Sorry, we're looking at Does the one of them have four? Am I wrong? Maybe. No, I think it's three. Is it three? Is it four? It's hard to tell. It's really hard to see. It looks like a divot was rubbed off, but I don't think that can happen. You can, you can rub off a divot? Interesting. They erased a hole. See, I assume that I jammed that fucker in there. See, th th this is so yeah, that clearly... looks right to me. That looks correct. Yeah, right. So, like, this should be able to get jammed into there. And you right. Can't. But that looks teeny tiny. Well, how big is the inventory? Fuck it. Don't even I care. The Going over the inventory item one. was like a door handle. Oh, maybe you can use it in there. Yeah, there we go. That's oh, it. it. Oh yeah. Hell yeah. You might have noticed by now that I've left a lot of puzzles for you to solve. Well. Oh, oh yeah. Yeah. Absolutely quern. Oh, I need some Shozo ruins in here. It's about time to find the ice beam. North shore. Sick, we're at the north shore, you guys. Oops, I minimized. 
We did a non-zero amount of progress. We're so sick. Yeah. All right, now we could go back, but I mean, I'm gonna explore all this stuff. Wow, these people lived inside of little pizza ovens. Yeah, I mean this this actually reminds me a lot of the <laughs> the area in Riven. Oh, yeah, it really reminds me of Riven. <laughs> He's uh, this culture learned a lot from playing Riven. <laughs> <laughs> Sure did. <laughs> what they did was they uh, <laughs> took some of this granite and they fucking pulverized it and then added some water to turn it into a dough man. Is that just a treasure chest? <laughs> yeah. Oh, man. H hell okay. yeah. yeah. Okay. Sweet. Oh, yeah. What? <laughs> Motherfucking treasure in there. Bioich. Wait, wait, wait. Go back. There was a... What was the sign on the, on to the right? With the angles there. Oh, uh, oh, uh, ah, uh, oh. Uh. That's an animation, crudely done. Right it's to a key, left, key framed. Right. Yeah, okay. Yeah. Ah, yes, the log sharpener. Okay, so I don't. <laughs> Alright, we, we have another letter from the guy. In all my days of logsmithing, I have never once found a log this pristine. <laughs> the sturdiness of this log makes me realize how powerful the Domarian environment must be. Alas. The Domarian ironwood, uh, uh, fucking uh, uh, ironwood smith. This sure Another letter. is special to me. By the right Hear of me. work I used to do here, help me calm my uh. restless mind. Besides preventing the natural decline of organisms, the phenomenon also eliminates any need of nutrition. Ugh. This means that despite the dry weather, the yeah, trees and bushes gains. around here could easily be millions of years old. Oh, millions! As I realize that time is no longer an obstacle, I have Everything the opportunity here could be a to billion. learn and perfect all of my artisan skills. This, this is the right very here. place where I became a craftsman. <laughs> After mastering blacksmithing and carpentry, I started to practice more advanced mechanical engineering. This is this is just him on a first date, and she's just like, uh huh, yeah. uh huh, uh huh. A lot of people don't know this when they first meet me, but I consider myself an intellectual. I sometimes do physical activity, but as you might imagine, it's not for my physique, which, though good, is merely a way for me to care for my mind, the true reason for my being. <laughs> you know, people behind the coffee shop counter are like, oh, God. Oh, Jesus. Oh, no. Can, can we poison his coffee? When a man like me creates a world... <laughs> <laughs> All right. Oh, is this? Is oh, open up! Open up! Damn it! That one's gear shaped. So the thing is that like you can see that there's like some some shine. We can see this that there's is some the very, the very plaza where I became a pizza artisan. <laughs> this is the very area where I grew my first bell peppers. Oh. Ooh. Wow. Tree. You ever you ever been a really into someone? Oh. By the way, for any of you who don't know, this is what it feels like. Uh, on the fritz, go. we're just gonna I'm gonna give you a little baby timeout. No back seating, please. No back seating, please. Three, please, sugar on top. Oh, oh you gave oh like somebody oh, you we're back. Okay. You laid the hammer down. Yes. What? And there was a hammer laid down there. What? Oh, that's, that hurts my eyes. Oh, God. Ah. Uh, oh. Wait, what are you doing? Are you... Uh, uh, okay. Ow. Does this hurt more? Number one or number two? Yeah, right? What? How? Why? That's terrible. So we have a contraption here. I hate it. Oh, it's just a key. It's just he just out there. Weird. Huh. Those look like uh, vacuum tubes. Wait, why were the vacuum tubes coming out of the crystal? So now we're going to start to see vacuum tube crystals? Yeah, I think he built some vacuum tube crystals. 
I really wonder what this entire contraption is all about. I mean, I think it's about two feet high. And honestly, just maybe this is just just his little fun thing. <laughs> just... <laughs> <laughs> oh shit! A boat. Okay, get the fuck out of here, man. Let's go. Let's yes. go home. Let's go to. Uh, I'm sure that like uh, we have to be just off the Hudson, right? Like we're we're probably very near. Um, New Jersey or New York or whatever it is. I don't know. I'm on the Never. West Coast. I don't know. All I know about the East Coast is that when you step off the plane, you're underdressed. Because they don't get it. Because they don't understand life. I don't understand what this is even for. It's a... Um, no, I don't know. It's a, it's a giant viewfinder. You're going to find a big... big Wheel view, damage. yeah. That's uh, that's just a simulation of how it feels for Sean to uh, watch um, 3D movies. Mm -hmm. See yep. this, this? My my right eye is watching the game, and my left eye is just reading chat, it's just seeing what's going on. Oh, Anyone yeah. who's out of line getting banned. You know what I mean? Get bland. Well, we have a lot of potential things. I'm pretty sure that this is... This looks like one of the keys to this thing. Over here. Oh, yeah. We gotta get that treasure chest open. Oh, sick. Oh, it's gone. It's gone. It's got one of those one-time keys. The key? the key was yeah. just... Okay. It absorbed the key. The key just went up and away. That key just got video gamed out of here. It's gone. It's... It's not actually a key, it's an anti-lock in the shape of a key when combined that was with a, a lock. Delete game object, open parentheses, <laughs> key, close parentheses. That's what just happened. Boom. It's a nice unity. Um Oh yeah. You might have noticed that you're playing a Unity game. Okay, so. I, mean, I don't know what this is for. I mean, it looks like a bad directions on how to unscrew something. It's like, I don't actually see any circular shapes except I here. I can't... Right, yeah, there are circular shapes there. I can't believe that it is, that arrow is pointing in the this, like, geographical direction. It feel, right, it, like it it's not feel, a feels like I'm being. It's not a sign that says like four screws this way. <laughs> it's pretty dumb, right? It's pretty stupid. <laughs> and this music is going harder than it needs. It's. We're we're really about to get some vocals, aren't we? <laughs> Like, we're going to hit verse one. <laughs> Pure moods. Just <laughs> another day in choir. Do you remember that old commercial for that, so that mixed taste that just kind of had general ethereal sounding electronica? Oh, that sounds Pure awesome. Pure moods. A return oh, yeah, pure to mood. innocence. Yes. Oh, yeah. oh, my God. Pure mood. Oh, uh, yes. <laughs> wow, I forgot about that. Oh, we did. We did not get vocals, but we got like a a, a, a violin. Quern, quern, quern. Dude, Dude, I'm telling quern. you, we literally we have fingers that just quern. protrude from our chest. That's oh my god! Can you We're not so get up close? There? <laughs> so Sean, close, to being... Sean. You're gonna have to make some more ladder run. You're going to need to make three rungs for a ladder. He's left us all of the supplies we need. That's right. This is a woodworking shop, and you have infinite time. You can become a master craftsman. Yeah, I mean, oh, yeah. my God. Okay. Day, did he literally say day-night cycle? You might have realized that you can't deal damage or uh, <laughs> do any charged <laughs> shots of any sort. You might... 
Fucking. <laughs> you might notice that you don't have a backpack, you have an inventory, but there's no day night cycle. There's a, um, fucking. Uh, there's a game. There's a game where you, you, uh. Might be Skyrim, actually. Where you talk to the guy who sells weapons and he says, Are you looking to deal some damage? And I'm like, Who are you, the DM? Like, what the fuck? <laughs> who says yeah. that? <sighs> Looks like you critted. <laughs> <laughs> That that puzzle also seems too easy to brute force, which makes me think there must be like more to it. Which puzzle? The the this one where there's like there's only two axes that you can change. See, so look, let's. Oh. Yeah. Do we want to just brute force? Yeah. Them? You know, I am gonna remember this particular skull device. Uh, this is very yeah. evocative. It is, it's true. This is the, it's a true evocative knowledge object. Yeah. What? That's what I'm Not, saying. There's, an, there's something something else to it. Yeah, what's that little tinier version of it right there? Up on itself? Is this connected Buttons? to the wires on the other side of the island? I think it is. Oh, that's an interesting idea. This game takes the notion of Riven's island-wide puzzles and does them very obtusely. <laughs> All right. Okay, here we go. Here we go. Oh, I know what that reminds me of. It's a PDP-8. Huh? It's a, um, it's an old computer looking thing, except you can only light up two lights at once. Well, Sean, I think that did nothing. This is like the kind of thing that you find at Burning Man and you play with it for 10 minutes and you're like, huh, cool. 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 And then later they install it in are, Oakland. Are, are those buttons, the four buttons, are those buttons? Or are they lights? Are uh, they a little lights? It's unclear. You know, I'm not sure. the whole button versus light thing is a real, a real head scratcher. I will uh, like concede that sometimes in real life I can't tell the difference between buttons and lights. Wait, so. I just had a thought. I just had a thought. Can you go back to the desk and find the crystals that have like the uh, little uh, tube amp tube amp tubes on them? Yeah, this the one. Uh, that. That, was, that, was that right there. That looks that looks real similar to those light buttons. Can you just grab that and shove it into the wall? I don't think I can. can. You grab that. Shove that into a wall. Oh my god, shit. I'm so annoyed right now. <laughs> the highs and lows. Yeah. Do, 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 do. Okay. Um And what and what what on earth does this garbage mean, huh? Forward, really? up, left, top um, left? I think it means don't let the sound of your own wheels drive you crazy. Mmm. <laughs> mm. So we have this oven-y thing. I don't know what to do with this. We That's have... For pizza. It's it, And it has a little hexagon on the bottom of it. Yeah, and I feel like this, I feel like we have the key for this. That also vaguely reminds me of the... It's just because they all look like screws, I guess. 
There's a whole lot of screws going on here. This is like a screw island. It's like, oh, are you a Phillips? Are you a flathead? Oh, are you one of those other things that people on Reddit say is better? Ooh. People on Reddit say that there's a better screw? Yeah, there's apparently a better screw. Huh. Do we have any screw heads in the chat? Any screw jockeys out there? Want to weigh in with your favorite screw types? Screw families? Do you have any favorite screw manufacturers? Any uh, favorite scr uh, screwologists? I mean, um, it does really, really seem like that is the thing that goes in that little hole. Yeah, see, like, is I it... want you to notice there's a little gear icon here. So let me ask you this gear. there. Uh, is a square head better than a Torx? Because I feel like maybe a Torx is better than a square head. What do you guys think? Team Torx or Team Damn. Square Head? Okay, is it like that one of these is the... Is it an orientation thing? Or is it like one of these? I, I, I don't understand why it's, it doesn't just work. e -Meeper is wondering if we noticed the uh, Among Us guy. Yeah, that's right. And I just wanted to point out Among Us. Honestly, it looks like an Among Us guy who's ready for bed. He is wearing his jammies, right? He's got his two big <laughs> buttons on his jammies. <laughs> oh. Is that a key for the things? Like, is there a connection between the, the screw-looking thing with multiple, like, slice lines and then the complete circle or the circle that extends to the bottom? I don't know. I feel like I'm speaking in gibberish. It's I think it's a crypto door handle with a sight attached. The only thing I can tell you is that if it was on my desk, I would be playing with it all day. That's It's an abstracted do not disturb sign. We shouldn't be doing any of this. <laughs> so here's here's the thing that I'm going to start with, right? I'm going to start with doing all eight orientations of this. Oh, shit. We're brooding. Okay. We're forced broodingly. Okay, but now, I, all right, I will also say, just for the record, from this perspective now, that middle one definitely has four... Uh, yeah. Four dealies, and we cannot handle four dealies. We are not equipped for that. I see what you're saying. I see what you're doing. I see what you're thinking. Okay, because this 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 is a simple way to brute force to say, okay, is this that, yeah, is everything that? that we need? I, I gotta tell you, I think it's too small. I think that the symbol, symbolical represent. No, I don't think that anymore. Never mind. Because it I also does look think like a mechanism. I, it can only go in the top one because it has the three things, and I think it's gonna um, disappear after we after we use it. I don't think it's gonna disappear after we use it. I do think. Oh, I that see what you're trying to get to that tumbler to move. We're gonna have to move the Among Us guy down first. No. Right? Uh, Lee, I think the tumbler goes the other way. I think that the tumbler right now is stuck into the Among Us guy and preventing oh, him from going down. I if see. we can get the tumblers out, okay. then Among Us goes down. Got it. So, the question is then, what is the correct orientation of this? Because there's... Oh, oh yeah. Oh, I see. Yes. You're right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Because here's what I was trying to do. Yeah, it doesn't come out. You're right. It doesn't come Man, out. And you're right about that Among Us guy. Yeah, because here, here's what I was doing. I thought that... Um, so first of all, the the, in, the orientation of the inventory was inverted. We, we actually should have been looking head on, and this doesn't. Mm. Um, actually, that, that should be fine. Yeah, no, when I was looking at this, I thought that we were going to insert the key into one hole, turn it, pull it out, rearrange it and turn it to another one, turn it. So I was testing ours on this one. There's only eight orientations of that. So right. it's actually much but, more straightforward. But it, but it couldn't be that because this key couldn't possibly work on the middle lock. That's true. It couldn't work on the four. 
Um, Which, so there must be different keys. That that was sort of my thought process. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Maldarian said, we pulled the thing out of the Among Us's head. Now he can speak to us. <laughs> That's pretty good. It's good game design. <laughs> it's good okay. game design. Um, that's weird because I thought that those little things were the size of like our thumb but they were the size of like our fist right you, you kept saying that and I never believed you whoa uh, that must mean that you thought that the texture on the rock or texture on the thing was larger than I did. I thought it was a finer grained texture on the mm -hmm. side of that material I see what you're saying yeah uh... It's sort of popcorn ceiling wall. Uh, oh wait, is our shit frozen? I think uh, you're frozen. Yeah. You you appear to be frozen to me. Oh wow, look at that. All right, hold on, everyone, everyone, stay here. Oh. I mean, that was weird. It's the second time today that shit's happened. Look. Okay, so... Uh, as I was I saying. Like the video camera becoming a still camera is very much like the escalator becoming stairs. <sighs> there we go. Although I heard that you're not supposed to walk on an escalator that has stopped because... Because, in theory... It could come loose and everyone could be shunted down. It could become a slide, basically. Mm, so you don't want to be there for that. That does seem like that's not ideal. Yeah. Crazy to think that this device is, is all that's left of that guy. Uh, friends, I am very stuck, confused, and annoyed. The, tr the Triforce of the show. There it is. Should we get another raging clue? I think I think it might be. Um, let's let's ask uh, Seeker. Seeker, I was wondering if you could give us uh -oh. a. Uh oh, we lost Sean Bloom. Sean Bloom, hopefully, will come back because I can't set this layup up very easily. There we go. Hi. Please load. Here we go. Yeah. Hey, look. Our Facebooks are coming back. Baron Jaeger. So, um, so let's let's begin by asking Seeker of 42. No one else, no one else. Give me a hint. Uh Seeker 42, if you have if you have a hint, I don't even know if Seeker is here. Let me just let me just blew up everything around here. Blue. So blue. Abu di Babu da. A blue di a blue da. All right, well maybe Super Odan's here. You know, maybe we can get a little Super Odan hint. Well, let's. Man, let's how first... fucking devious would it be if there was like a clue written on the fucking treasure chest? Can you imagine? Fuck. <laughs> yeah, I mean, I actually am not sure. I like this whole. Pull out your blues. Get your clues. Just dark light everything. I I feel like there's a reason that in escape rooms it gets deployed the way that it does, which is like, you know, once and in a pretty specific area. Uh, um, oh, this is awesome. I mean, Super Odan says we haven't clicked on something, which is terrific. The last it's, time I deployed oh, something shit, that you yeah, could yeah, look at from a dark light, it was definitely once and in a very specific area. In an escape. <laughs> Watch this um, motherfucker is just making rebar. What about? And he left it. He was in the middle of making rebar and he just left. He just oh, left. holy shit. Oh, shit. Oh, damn. Oh. What? It goes up and down. Can you pull it up, up? 
if you pull it further up? No, it just sort of dances. Oh, yeah. No, you can. Oh. I don't understand. What the hell is okay, it so, doing? Okay, so here's what we're trying to do. It, it's, it's, a, it's a puzzle where we, we pull it either right or left. And if we pull it left, that's the wrong one. If we pull it right, that's the correct one. If we pull it right, that's... Like, if I pull it right, it'll crash back down. So we're trying to find the right. correct true or false right, sequence. Right, left, right. What? All right. Right, left, left, right, left. All right. No, it's right, left, 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 right, left, left. Right. Ugh. All right. Okay. Um, groovy. That was weird. Mm. Oh, I. I'm. Oh, good. I'm not getting the audio. Anyway, there we go. That's better. All right. Wait, there was things on that there thing. Did you see that, Sean? I did. There was a clue on the treasure. What was there a clue on the treasure? See. Oh. Look at that. Look at them. Now with more screw types. Oh, okay. Huh. Is it a math? Is it is... It looks like a math. Thanks for pointing that out, Leah. I would have completely missed that. I swear to God. Oh, is the this... first thing that they do when they make these games is like, I'm going to make some symbols that represent numbers. Okay, this does have a slash across the middle. Yep. It does? Yeah, yeah, it's hard to it does. Shit, no, you're See right. See how there's a horizontal line across the center of this one? I think I think you're right. There's I still three that are that. empty. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. So those are zeros. Probably. What are what are the what are the slashes that we had? It was it was four. Oh that's right. So so right? I think that this might be It's a math. This one, two, three, four might be uh -huh. what we're looking at. That's what so I think. So then five would be... Would well, be an X. Why, why would it be an X? Because it's four plus one. Oh, uh, one of those motherfucking things, yeah. But the thing is that, like, how would you represent five then? Because you could have three plus two or four plus one. No, no, no. It's, a, it's like a, it's a, a counting system. It's a, it's a quadrinary counting system but you're but you're adding together so it'd be so a five is a four plus one a six okay. is a four plus two okay so so hold on so so we have this is so we have one right and then we have two and then we have three and we have i feel like most oops. of what we do in this show is just xeno arithmetic one So like, yes. Why does this mean that the next symbol is this? Because we just kept this last one and added a one to it. And add, so you're yes. overlaying you're overlaying a four and a you're overlaying a one and a four. To make so all nice. so the next the next four numbers are all gonna have that four diagonal slash and then also a one, yeah. a two, or a three. So I mean, they're all gonna have this. Yeah. yeah. That's what I think. Yep. I feel like this would... This I would... don't know how to represent an 8. I don't know how to... Re Maybe it's 0. Huh. Maybe an 8 is an 80? Melt Frost, this is exactly how it worked in Riven. Uh, I'm surprised. Sean P is surprised. I don't think it worked this way in Riven. Because, I mean, look. So, if we if we think about in... Um, in, in usual uh, arithmetic... Right, or a uh, number represent you go like one, two, three, four, and then if you wanted to get to five, and let's if let's say you're in you're in some sort of trinary system, you'd go one one. You'd use two bits. So this would be five. Or you do one zero. Uh um yeah. wait, I'm doing it the other way. Yeah, I'm I'm there we go. Yeah, yeah, like this. Yeah, so may, may, maybe the empty is is zero. I would have guessed an empty was zero and it only counts up to seven, but... Um... Yeah, see, the thing is that, like, okay, let's take the, the number, like, 1,002. This is one in the thousand slot, nothing in the hundreds or the tens slot, and this is in the single slot. 
So if you wanted to do binary, right, if this were binary, this would be um, 1 plus 0 plus 0 plus 8, right? So this would be the representation of 9. But the idea yep. is that you actually have a slot for each thing, right? So if I remember correctly right. in Riven, I don't exactly remember, but I feel like Riven was um, a system where you actually, the, the slots, like this digit corresponded to this slot and this digit corresponded to this slot, right? Like the, each of the corners. So if you wanted to like represent the next thing in the um, in the sequence, you'd actually, you wouldn't leave this bit alone. You would actually just set this somewhere else. Well, okay, can we go back to the treasure chest and see if all of the ones that have two lines include that diagonal slash, that four slash? Because that's my theory. That's a backslash, right? I actually don't know. If that's what is true. this thing that we have? I actually, I'm, I'm. Now that I see that I'm wrong, I'm changing my theory rather than. Wait, are you wrong? I think I you're wrong. right. I think you're right. No, all the some ones that of have them, two. No, that's not. Some of them have forward slashes. No, no, but they all have forward slashes. The ones that have two. So, so here's what I'm gonna do. No, we, we, there's we, the we, one top left has a back and a horizontal. We can just remember oh. these uh, shapes. So let's just remember. Oh, we could also shapes. press P. Press P. Oh sure. To take a whiz. You've probably noticed by now that you're really good at sketching in this world. Yeah. <laughs> I used to spend hours just sketching to regain my physique to be able to lose my mind while wandering. My mind wandered. Okay, so if we. Okay, Henry, Henry David Thoreau, Jesus. Okay. I came to the woods to spend hours sketching to build my physique. Great. Right. Well, now we have a handle. Mm. Okay, so now we can brute force it much more slowly. This whole island's a damn cable car. So... What? <laughs> maybe it's these combination of lights correspond to one of the... Hmm. Like, oh, if we go shit. to our... In oh, that's a, notebook. those are base four as well, you guys. You guys, those lights are base four as well. Are they? We'll How see. so? What do you because mean? because there's two rows of four lights each. It's like okay, a PDP. It's like a can, PDP eight. So is this one? But we can only turn two of them on. So here's what I think. Okay, so riddle me this. If if for example, if that top row you see there is like a number one and then a number two. I'm guessing that we're going to want to put the, in the first column of lights, put the second light from the bottom on, and then the next one, or, sorry, the first light from the bottom on, and then the second column, the second light from the bottom. And then we hit the lever, and then that it'll gives lock us one of our four lights. On one of the, one, yeah, it'll turn on one of the LEDs. This is so, Linux. So the thing is that lights... This is so, Linux. So I think the, here, here's, here's my theory. So if you follow my mouse, I didn't take a photo of the other one, uh, but it's... It's a... Um, yeah, but you have an MS Paint drawing of it, so... Yeah, it's... Oh, yeah, great. Yeah, so it's forward, uh, down, vertical, like this. So this is the first symbol. So I think we need to figure out how to generate, because it, it had this arrow going like this, right? Yes. So I feel like this is the first symbol we need to, like, generate or match or do something like this. So the first symbol is a leaning forward thing. So we have this leaning forward thing with a slash above it. So maybe we pair this with this one, so that way this slash and this slash cancel out, leaving us with this. This is kind of what I'm thinking. Okay. I didn't follow that, but it sounds good. I sort of did, and I'm, I'm not sure I buy it, but go for so it. So let me, let, let me just restate. I mean, we're just so, making numbers, right? We're just making numbers. So if no, I- No, we're more making weird patterns. So now. this th this was the direction. Uh, yes. That, oh my God. Me out of here. So it showed us this, and then it had an arrow doing this. So I feel yes. like we need to generate this shape first, this shape second, this shape third, this shape fourth. This is kind of what so I now think. Now we're generating shapes. Okay. So this is, this is kind of what I'm thinking. Uh, and so the question is, I was thinking, uh, yeah, okay. how do we make this shape? And I'm not saying this is right. I'm just saying here's what's happening inside of my mind. Sure. So how yeah. do we make this? I lean thought the treasure chest. 
Well, I was it, reading the treasure chest to be like what you're reading here. I thought the treasure chest showed us the order of shapes we had to make. Right. Well, the thing but, is that I think that these correspond to the four lights that we're looking at. So I think what we need to do is we need to shine the eyeball yes, and like right, shine right, this right. eyeball and this eyeball together because it looks like this slash and this slash correspond, but this and this doesn't correspond. So the difference between them is the one or some shit like that. Okay. I, I, I mean, I don't. I don't get that, don't but you're right about, about that, that layout. You're right about the layout of the two columns of four being the definitely, same layout. definitely, definitely, definitely. Yeah. So again, if they had only documented this better. So I, I, I guess I don't understand um, what this row of things means. I think that they are numbers, but I don't know what to do with that. And then you think that they represent a sequence. Yeah. But, excuse me, Desper. So he, what if, okay. Hey, wait, 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 if we're doing crazy stuff, uh, go back to the, to, to that, to the, the drawing, to our sketch. Mm -hmm. So, um, what if instead, uh, instead of what you were doing with like subtracting lines, what if, uh, there's two, two of these circles have that forward slash in them. Oh, okay, right? yeah. on the, on the, let's just do those two. Nice. Fuck yes. Oh, okay. shit. So, they both so have the second one. one's vertical line. So it's this and this, right? They both have the vertical yeah. line. Nice, nice yeah. call. Oh, buddy. This is exactly the kind of shit where, like, if you work on a team, one person will write it down and they'll be like, uh, like, like this makes sense to you guys, right? Like, this is pretty easy um, to get. By the way, like, uh, what the fuck did you just draw? To, to everyone in chat, everyone is saying you did it well done relief. We're not done with the puzzle yet. There is a chance that we would wind up being wrong a high percentage of the time. It happens to be that we're right here, but I want you to imagine in the future we're solving a puzzle and we think we're onto something. I will then take tacit silence in that circumstance to mean that we're on the wrong track. So again, please don't celebrate our victory until we've done it. Even if we're 99% done, wait till we've actually solved it, please, next time. Because um, now I know that that we're on the right tracks. This is one, this is two, and this is three. Okay. This is it. All right, here we go. And the final one is going to be a scratch. Here we go. So we have this and this. Because it's the yeah. tilties. All right, cool. Yeah. <laughs> it's Hell a key. Yeah. It unlocks a key, which unlocks a key, which unlocks a key. Wait, I don't think that's a key. I don't think that's a key. I think it's a, a, a wind up. Wind up. For the yeah. fucking boat, it winds up the fucking oh, yeah. boat. There it is. Oh, Let's get out of here. Let's wind up this boat yeah. and leave. Oh, now up, everyone is time to tell up. us we're geniuses. And by us, I mean Sean Bloom. Is this the end of the game? <laughs> yes. Is this the end of the game? Wait. I mean, guys. This, this guys, we're going to have to move sucks, that so. island. <laughs> we're going to have to move. Oh. Guys. Do, do, we got do, off. Do, do, do. Set now we're sail. in a cinematic, huh? Oh god, oh, we're gonna get caught by the- oh shit! Oh, we're not! Oh, no. Okay. We're just- we're finally awake. Now, I want to stress to all of you, remember we have M&Ms for feet. Like, if this just That's tilts true. a little bit, we topple over and drown immediately. Oh god. Definitely. Wait. Oh god, oh. it's just more corn. We're, we're gonna be able to open up a door now. Get back to where we uh, were before. Pirates of the Caribbean, Mr. Lincoln Logs, Mr. or Mrs. or Mix Lincoln Logs. We're over here. We? We're over, over here. There. Okay. All right. Sweet. Oh, Jesus.
We took a whole ass boat to go like 10 feet. <laughs> With cinematic music. <laughs> All right, go, go yeah. ahead. If only we had arms, we could swim. But we don't. We just, we're just M&M's on m and Are we going to have to open that door by listening to it? <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> Stupidest machine I've ever seen in my life! Dude, only <laughs> Professor John Tholomon Mayhew, or whatever his name is. We're, we're so gonna have this to listen like to a tune. Is this fucking Dr. Seuss's origin story? Is that what this is? <laughs> oh, I spent a thousand God. years creating strange devices. It's hard to even explain how goddamn bored I was. <laughs> I decided to make a lock with a thing that blows on the lids of things and goes... <laughs> oh my god, we have our complete frame rate destruction. Ugh, look, it's the frame rate destruction juice. What does right, it say? Watch this, yeah, watch what, this. Is, what does it say? I think it's great. I thought it was the bees yeah. that caused the destruction. Oh, yeah, the his taxes. Yeah. Right. Are these just like different people's names? Like he just like uh, drained the I core out of. Them? Oh my God! Look at this. One oh, X of her. No. This. One X of. Oh. <laughs> okay, we gotta figure out how to pronounce these, right? I think the first is Ferv. And the right, second fair. is taxis. Ferv. Yeah, it's ferv taxis. Okay. Yen. Yen. Yen, and yeah, then that, that, you. Dude, that, that's do. That's in the morning when you get do. 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 So we have ferv taxi, morning, yen, do. and do. do. Morning, do. 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 Oh, the do. All right. Can we make a drink called D-H-E-W? Do you? Do yeah, so so why is it 1x, 1x, 2x, 1x, and then 1x? Oh my god, 1X. you guys, we actually have to make do. We gotta do the do. Yeah, let's We're make do with it. Soda combination flavors. So duh. We have to make Baja Blast. Absolutely. And serve it with some <laughs> Ecto Cooler. Um, some Taco Bell quesarito poppers. It's Alongside a Mountain Dew game poppers. Fuel. <laughs> We're looking for the mutated. right thing. They to... just took Mexican food and mutated it. I saw some fucking sheet music on the wall there, son. If you look up a little Did bit you? on the left, behind you, right behind you, right behind you, right behind you. There it is. Oh, oh shit. Ah, oh, oh, oh. Perfect. Now you try. Perfect. Yeah. Do you think those are uh, <laughs> semitones or whole tones? Probably semitones. All right. Well, the something. thing is that I got five of these fucking things. So so let's let's look at this one. So oh we can just take it? Fuck yeah. So um I'm gonna put this here and when I pull this, does it blow? Is this the first one that gets blown? We're gonna have to play a tune. <laughs> Alright, so give me this. All right, All right so we, got, we got this. We got this. What do you think is Can the middle see? size? Oh, they've of... got lines on them, Sean. They've got lines on them. Do the lines correspond to the notes? Do the I don't think no, they, they just notes? all have three. So I, I think yeah, it's... I think the... I so, think the... It's the volume. I think it could go by volume. Yeah, I think, I think you're correct. So I'm gonna... What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna arrange them in what I believe is order of size. So this, I think, will go up. In terms of... No. Oh. Okay, so these were so switched. Were... Now, th this is, again, this is just to determine uh, tone. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, we're just figuring out, yeah. All right, so, so our middle noted one is actually this one. So. God. Imagine a culture whose instruments are just pot pottery that they make. I guess it's blowing my mind. This should be a novel. It should be a Quern book. Okay, hold on, hold on, processing. Dragon Riders of Quern. Wait, I couldn't remember. 
Wagon oh. Riders of Quern. Middle, second highest. Lowest. Oh, I see. There's one, two, three, four, five, six, but we have five. That's why my mental model is broken. Yeah, so it's second highest, lowest, highest, second lowest. All right. That's that's the hard mode talking. So, Children of the Quern. So this is <laughs> second highest. Leprechaun 5000 said thinking cap engaged. So we need lowest. the lowest, and then we need the, the highest. Which then Oh my leaves. god, we are just obliterating puzzles. I feel good about this. It's possible Mostly there's running. a six sixth pot somewhere yeah. that's screwing this up, but Holy shit, it's this fucking piece of shit over here. You fucking asshole. Hey! Alright. Old Johnny Six Pots. I'm so annoyed. This is so dumb. All right, well, let's just solve this puzzle. We're I find I find a there... fucking sealed letter that's gonna be like, wouldn't it be a bummer if there was six pot? No. <laughs> so I, I I think that this is actually the right one. That asshole probably threw all these pots too. What do you think? Oh, you've got to be fucking kidding me, man. Okay. It's got a nice melody, but I can't dance to it. And then oh. this is the highest note. Okay, so then this is actually third lowest. It's dead middle. Uh, there is no dead middle because there's six. So, uh, huh, uh -huh, so it's uh -huh, uh -huh, <laughs> dead middle. <laughs> so uh, there's <laughs> lowest, so funny. second lowest, third. So it's this one, and then this one is just not used. Huh? Because that's fourth, right? Fuck that one. Yeah, yeah. The, the weird middle jar. No one likes. Everyone hates. They always have. So what we need to do is we need to get the third lowest, which is this weird oblong guy. So this is third, and then second highest is going to be the one that we just took, which is not this one. It's like this weird one that I wouldn't have. No, this is the second highest, right? Second highest, then we want absolute dead lowest. So this is middle. Right? This is then we want the absolute highest, which is this one. Alright, yeah, there we go. Then we want the second from the lowest, which is this fucker. Yeah. Look, this, this, this is a big. I know. Big it's ears. Pretty wild. This is what Kaiser Permanente is doing with my blood right now. <laughs> this is this is actually what um, Theranos hoped would happen inside of the Edison with a pinprick of blood. <laughs> Elizabeth Holmes was like, oh "We've tested the technology. It works. God Just listen it. in closely." <laughs> uh. <laughs> and wow. before, before the fifth note was played, the Walgreen executives went, it sounds legit. Yeah, put it in our stores. Yeah. She's got a real uh, low jug voice. It's true. Gardens. Is it draining wow. water? Is the water level? No, we're just no. taking a leak. It's been a thousand years. <laughs> <laughs> I knew we'd get some valves in. Oh. Uh oh! Oh! Irrigation! You know, you don't want to overwater those. Where am I? Oh, I'm in the gardens. I'm over here. I'm over here now. Maybe people overwater succulents because it's the only thing you can do with them. 
You can't do anything else with them. What is this? Look thing? at them, I guess. What else can you do with oh. different things? What? I mean, a, a lot. Oh. It depends on the affordances, Sean. It depends on the affordances. I know exactly what the fuck this thing is. Okay, Life hold crystal, on. Life crystal, motherfucker. Life crystal. Life crystal. Dude, it like seriously. It worked so well for Brink. We're absolutely gonna wow, do the wake really me up. On the brink of disaster. Wake me up inside. John, don't mess with life crystals unless you know that everyone is safe. Okay, so I bet you. Give me the key. Eeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeee
Okay, let me just figure out how to manipulate the, the crab Holy grabbers. Crap. Huh? <laughs> there was a thing that you could pick up there, wasn't there? Where? Holy uh, fucking shit. Also, to the right here. To the right what? of this. No, 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 no. Go back. Okay. There. To slightly left. These flasks. Can you pick up a flask? No? No. No, that was a no. graphical glitch. Sorry. <laughs> Colonel Henry David Thoreau Sanders. <laughs> Great character. <laughs> oh, I have a spoon. Ugh. The okay, blue is not dank enough. Okay, hold on, let me just finish Pixel Spam. On me. Holy I, I, shit! Doggles on me. I hope you enjoyed the ride. Unfortunately, fuck you. the boat was only designed to get you here. Yeah, this fuck is you. the place where I dive deeper into learning about the vegetation of the island. Though herbology okay. and chemistry were far from my original expertise. All right. By studying the right. experiments, recipes, and manuscripts of the Dolmarians, I had everything I needed to master these arts. At the time, I thought the opportunity this place offered me was a blessing. I was a wanderer back then, who always enjoyed being alone. Oh. Yes. Oh, I've boy. never been a people. This person. is a first day, Lee, you're totally right. Though I was undoubtedly no. on my own, sometimes I had the strange feeling that someone or something was watching me. Anyways, I had a great night. Do you want to do this again sometime? So let's I see thought here. this went really well. <laughs> so. This is brutal. The fuck? All right. <laughs> it's Quacks of Quedlinburg. Sh <laughs> what? Load. There you Shwabba are. Daba said he's going to tell us about crypto in the next letter. <laughs> oh my god, yeah. <laughs> Listen, I've I've decided to create an yeah. NFT for the moment where you revitalize those plants according to my instruction. I'm really excited. I think this will have a lot of value someday. And it's great because it creates value for the artist too. What you have to understand about the blockchain is... I don't know. I yeah. can't. That's it. That's as far as I can take it. There's yeah. nothing that you have to understand about the blockchain. I There, there was this tweet that I, I loved... Um, so much and how did it go um yeah it was like china uh banned cryptocurrency and elon musk's girlfriend dumped him everyone check in on the most annoying person you've ever met in your life today <laughs> oh my god that's so good oh man uh, so so i mean uh oh let me Oh, there we go. That was a good yawn. Um, yeah. Gotta be careful when you do that, because the cat's gonna jump in there. Oh, dude, Despy loves to smell my yawning mouth. She's like, this is good stuff oh. for me. Oh, that's the good shit right there. Um, okay, so... smell like a baka. Couple of things. Um, I was having a chat with Britt uh, earlier today, because uh, I popped out and she was playing mm -hmm. Control. And there's this one puzzle in Control where... It's not actually really, calling it a puzzle would be way overstating it. Basically, sure. there is a little um, cube that's flashing that looks kind of like a battery. And there's a door that's locked. Now, if you look up, you will see up there, there is a slot that's blinking at the same pulsing rate as the cube. And mm -hmm. at some point, you're supposed to intuit that you need to pick up this cube and plug it into this spot that's on top of the wall sure. by throwing it so well of course this actually obviously yeah because you have a, a power where you can like pick things up with esp right. and then just like throw it somewhere and i remember when oh, i got that's there sick that sounds tight it's really fun like it's really 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 good also yeah, it looks controls like pretty good lee your camera appears to just not be registering there we go it's back i don't know what's going on with this encoder today but whatever um the yeah, so you, you have this ability to pick things up and throw them places. So you're both you're, you're supposed to kind of like intuit that you can pick this up, and instead of throwing as a form of offense or violence, that you can throw to place 
what you, after the fact, look at and go, oh, that's a battery, and that's a battery slot, and they plug into each other. And oh. I feel like this is a problem that a lot of games that try to do some high-fidelity graphics sort of classic AAA design do, where the world is supposed to feel real and alive and natural. It's not that you have, like... you know, like, like boxes as inventory items and you hurl them at people. That would be too unrealistic. No, it's that you pick one up from the environment around you and you throw it. And the game doesn't want to go put batteries into these slots here because that ruins one of the core funds of that kind of game, which is like the immersion in the environment and the feeling like you are actually just picking things up that would be there naturally and interacting with them. And this area that we're in, feels like an amazing example of like, these things are all decorative, but it happened to be that there was one jar here that I needed to know to click on. And so I went through this area and spam clicked and discovered that some of the stuff was actually pick upable. But, but some of them that were indistinguishable from all of the other ones. Yeah, and I feel like this is something that I actually kind of appreciate from older games that could never have dreamed of creating an immersive visual high fidelity environment so what do they do you step in and it just shows that the key is glowing bright orange and twinkling and it's the only bright glowing thing in the entire screen and i kind of for this reason like games that are really gamey mm -hmm. you know they're just like oh fuck the immersion here's the mechanics and here's how you interact with things and there's some art here in support of that you know like slay the spire just says here's exactly how many points of damage things are doing and how much things cost and what the points of damage are there's no there's no intuitive like ooh i realize if i wear this wooden armor it will be better against lightning attacks and the metal armor none of that shit man uh and i think that there's actually a setting oh. in here that says interaction helper yeah oh i have a i have a favorite game i have a favorite game for that which is uh mirror's edge where it's Holy like this is a runny jumpy game shit. everything you need to go toward is red just go to the red oh yeah, yeah. by the way okay um, I'm gonna show I'm gonna show you you all this. Okay, look at this. So um, we know that these things are interactable, right? Yes. We yeah. know. Now watch this. When I go to settings and I turn on the interaction helper, they emit twinkles. Oh, oh, twinkles. Now remember the desk I was it's looking at. Still pretty subtle. It's pretty subtle, but you know, there's most. It helps. Time. Yeah, 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 totally. It turns out this is oh, interactable. Shit. Okay, and this page what is interactable. Fuck? And then, and get ready, every single one of these is interactable. Damn, look at all those powders oh, and different shit. colors. Look, look at, at all those, those different yeah. powders and different colors that are powders. I would have never, ever thought, I thought I was done with this entire desk. It, I love that one of them, the blue powder is, is, is in a fucking... It's, just in, a, a it's in a day nine mug. TV yeah. mug, man. That's a, yeah. it's a motherfucking coffee mug. Yeah, and see, like, I, I'm going to wander back through. Oh, yeah, this is interactable. Yeah, oh, that's actually so helpful. Oh. I wish I'd had that on the entire time. Mm -hmm. You know, that's what cats, the, the world just looks like that to them. Whenever we touch something, <laughs> it starts emitting those bubbles, those little dots. It, it might actually, <laughs> if you think about it. Like, yeah. Like, we, we separate senses differently, but really a lot of it is the same sort of shit colliding with our body, and there's different things that process this. Um, wow, that's that's insane. Um, so, anyways, I, I just, I think about this a lot that, or I, I thought about this a lot this afternoon, where it's like, yeah, man, it's sometimes really hard to know what the heck you are even allowed to do uh, in right. games. Like, what is relevant and what is no god. <sighs> Okay, it's 9.15. We, we're going to have to wrap this puppy up. Uh, uh, Sean Lee, do you have any uh, final thoughts about our our excellent uh, video game of uh, Quern that we played through today? I mean, fun, good stuff. Uh, some, like, wild highs and lows today. Like, it, it it's... Uh, it is. This is one of those classic puzzle games, classic adventure games uh, that we have maybe mm. not played in a little while in a, oh, yeah. in a, in a minute. And um, we get those like moments of what the hell is there to do? It feels like we've done everything. And then, uh, and then it all clicks and we get like a rush of progress. Oh yeah. Uh, it felt good. Whoa. Um, 
Yeah, I would say that this was one of those episodes we have that has a very strong act two for whatever reason. Yeah. <laughs> I'm excited to see like how much of the island we wind up unlocking because I feel mm -hmm. like this appears to be implying that this is a one island game. Yes. Well, it also could be implying that there's a multi-island game and when we get off this one, suddenly we're in a completely different place. Let me see, Quern, how long to beat? I, I do, f I'm curious what the answer is, but I feel like uh, our goal now is to open that portal up so that we can go home. Yeah, that's what, and you know, one thing I really love is when a game does a surprise twist where it's building up to that and then you get there and then it re you realize, oh, this is when I get access to seven more worlds. And you're like, oh, shit. Whoa. But this game, it says that it takes about 15 hours to beat. So we've done four. Like and four, four for us yeah. is about okay. an hour and a half for other people. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. What? All right. All right. So okay. this game is bigger than Grand Theft Auto 3. There it is. <laughs> um. I hope at the end we we look in a fucking mirror and realize that we're the guy and we just had all of our memories erased. Oh my god! And we look at our <laughs> hands the whole time, and we begin to tremble because we realize these are the hands of a douchebag, right? Like such a huge. <laughs> I do legitimately yeah. wonder, like the 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 properties of this world are that time basically doesn't move while you're here, and. Yeah. Uh, and so he spent, you know, whatever, years or decades doing all of this stuff and setting up these puzzles. And then what, waiting for us to arrive from a yeah. from a world where there is time? Like, wouldn't it take an infinite amount of time for us to show up? Yeah. Okay. This guy's full so what? You do know that at some point we will. But will we? I mean, is... Okay. I mean, we did. So there's this, there, like, I will say, there, there is something that Dark Souls does that I think is really nice is it tries to explain why everything is the way it is in world. So sure. why is it that when you die, you respawn back by the last save point? Well, it's not because there's save points. It's because the game explains what the curse of the undying is and then also explains that this entire world is connected to the idea of fire and rebirth and what it means to be, you know, a dying flame. And everything is, like, thematically in tune. But it takes that theme and then it explores it a bunch, you know? It builds on that. It doesn't just use it as, okay, here's an explanation for the, the save points. Okay, it, it like does more stuff. And I feel like this game sure. had an opportunity to be like, well, we're going to have a flat world where everything stays completely fixed. That's because time doesn't really move here. Isn't that strange? And I feel like if other objects in this abided by that, it doesn't evolve, it doesn't change, you know? Like if there right. was... Some other thing that, that feels like layering that on top makes me feel more satisfied about the other lore explanations. Because I have this feeling of like, oh, so instead of like being able to hire more artists, because they were probably constricted via funds, they just wrote a one page narration <laughs> that explains why they didn't have a day night cycle. You know what I mean? And I was kind of like, ah, okay, no, I'm not saying that you should be ashamed for not doing a day night cycle. I'm just saying that like I wanted, I, I went, oh, cool, time's frozen. Then I, I kind of wanted more. Um, I'm I'm curious if, if we will get any of that in this next section where we're dealing with living things like that oh. feels like an opportunity for oh. a little bit more exploration of this concept. I guess what I'm proposing is the twist ending at the end of this game is that this dude who has been leading us through this maze exists in an instant of time that is previous to the one that we are inhabiting. Uh, and it, all of the things that he did have been left for us because time flows forward, but he will never, we will never meet him because he is living his entire existence in uh, an unmoving instant of time oh. uh, before we got here. Like he's trapped in a block of amber at the front of a train that we're also trapped in a block of amber on. 
Yeah, th- yeah, that actually, I, I, I actually yeah. really like that. I really like. I think it's beautiful. Well, I'm gonna just go. Mm-hmm. All right. Yeah, let's just go get out of here, watch something on TV, and then go to bed. That's exactly what I'm gonna do. For me, I'm gonna go watch Only Murders in the Building. There it is. Oh, I love that for you. It's I, so I, good. I, yeah. Wow. Oh, by the way, um, uh, one of the all-time greatest streamers in the history of Twitch is uh broadcasting live and it's her birthday so we're gonna go raid x mira mira and we gotta wish her happy birthday here we go